Hey everyone, in this tutorial, we're going to be using the newsletter WordPress plugin to create custom HTML email templates that were created by postcards. So the first thing we have to cover is the newsletter tags. These tags allow you to have the option of adding customizability to your email. So for example, if you add the name tag to your email, that will change from the name tag to the recipient's actual name that they've entered. Another important tag is the unsubscription URL tag, and this is what allows the email recipient to unsubscribe if they wish. So next up, we're going to add these tags to the postcards template. All right, so I've went ahead and created a simple little postcards template and now I'm going to be adding the tags to this template. So to do that, I press in the header seven area that will open up a new menu. And what I want to do is add the name tag in the title area here. So I will press the title option. And when I press it, it opened up, it opens up a new option to change the text. So in here I'll add the tag. So, the tag here is looks like this, it's name. So I will just copy this, go back to the text editor and add something like, hey, copy paste name app is available for iOS and Android. And now I've added the name tag to this template. And so when the email gets sent, this tag will be changed to whatever the person's name is. And I'll press done. And next up, I will add the unsubscription URL tag. So I'm going to copy this, go back to the postcards app. And at the bottom, I want to change this email to unsubscribe and change the URL from an email to the unsubscribe URL tag. So to, to do that, I press this middle area, which opened up this menu. Then I pressed column two. I'm going to scroll all the way to the bottom until I find the text. So here I want to change from the email to unsubscribe and the URL from the email to the tag. I will press done. And now all the changes in our template are finished and now I can export it. So I'm going to press the export button, press download as zip. And I'm going to make sure this host images online option is checked so that I don't have to manually upload and update each image in this template. Postcards will just take care of it and serve the images from their server. So I'll press download zip. And now it's downloading. I'm going to save it to my desktop. Going to open it up. And this index.html file is everything that we need. So I'm going to open up my desktop and extract that file into my folder so that I can use it. And if I open this up, you'll see that it's just the template that we just created. And next up, we're going to add the HTML code to the newsletter template. Alrighty, so now that we have our index.html, we want to open this with a text editor. So I will right click this and press edit with notepad plus plus any text editor will do. And what that will do is open the index.html file in a text editor and you can see the code. You don't have to understand what's going on. You just have to be able to copy and paste this. So now back in the newsletter dashboard, I'm going to press new newsletter. And then I'm going to press raw HTML because we have the HTML to add. And that will open up a 
text editor with HTML code. So now I can just copy and paste the code from the postcards template. So back in Notepad++, I press Control A to highlight everything, Control C to copy everything. And now back in here, I'm going to replace everything, delete and paste. And now we've successfully imported the code into the newsletter template. So I will scroll down and press save. And now there is a button or an eyeball icon. So if I press this, you will see the HTML template successfully working in newsletter. And now at this point, you have a template that you can use for your newsletter email campaigns. And here is the final page for you to edit the newsletter and you can send it, you can schedule it, you can do whatever. And yep, yeah, hope you've learned something. That was how to create a custom HTML email template in newsletter using postcards. Until next time, see you guys later.